State governors elected under the platform of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, have explained that they supported the emergence of Prince Uche Secundus as the PDP national chairman because of his strength and character and honesty. Also, PDP national chairman Prince Uche Secundus prophesied that the new National Working Committee would take the party to the promised land. The governor stated that Prince Uche Secundus, as a national deputy chairman, stood for the truth and ensured that rules were adhered during party primaries. They spoke at a Thanksgiving in honor of Prince Uche Secundus, national chairman of the PDP at the River State Economical Center in Port Harcourt on Sunday. River State Governor Yesom Ezonwike said every governor gave testimony on how the national chairman stood firm for the right thing to be done. Every governor gave testimony to how the national chairman stood firm when all of them were running elections. For me, in particular, he said, as a deputy national chairman, Prince Uche Secundus relegated monetary considerations and also ensured the promotion of PDP interest. And all I will appeal to him and members of National Working Committee: God is using you. To see that this country gets the best. Therefore, it behoves on you not to see it as an opportunity to enrich yourself. Governor Wike said that Secundus insisted on the emergence as PDP governorship candidate because he felt it was in the best interest of the party, even though other groups preferred an ethnic candidate. See it as an opportunity to help Nigeria. Because, like we are saying, whether you like it or not, the, the sufferings of the people, the difficulties now, <laughs> I thought you can survive it in another four years. So, see this as an opportunity to give Nigeria what they want. Don't see it as an opportunity. I'm a member of the National Working Committee. You can set up to begin to collect money from people. If that happens, you will see the handwork of God. If that happens, you will see the handwork of uh, God. You have no choice to like our people. I can't understand why we can continue to buy fuel 300 to 400 naira per liter. And he said we are going to survive it. And people are giving excuses upon excuses. This is no period of excuses at all. He said that Prince Uche Secundus emerged through a credible process where all candidates tested their popularity. He said that governors and other stakeholders preferred Secundus because of his experience and track record. What I can tell all of us here and which the national chairman said is that for the first time in the history of our party and i want anybody to challenge us this is the first time we have had an election for the chairman of the party <laughs> what was the case before where leaders of the party for Mr. President and the governors will sit and say this is their candidate and nobody will contest with that person and they say it is consensus candidate. Cross River State Governor Professor Ben Ayadi said that he encountered Prince Uche Secundus when he had a major challenge in the delegate list of the party, but the former Deputy National Chairman insisted on correcting the illegality without inducement. In my days when I was seeking to be Governor of Cross River State, we had a major problem with our local elections in such a way that there was a major change in our delegates' election. In the process, we started struggling working with the National Party to see how we can effect a change. In the normal politics, we have to move money around to see how you can get things done. Three times I went to see Secundus. 
our national chairman today struggling and saying look i have come with something for you to see how you can support us effect and reverse the illegality that has taken place in Kosovo. three times he turned down the money but most of us who went for him we reflected on the support he gave to us without asking without taking a time even when the offer was given without him soliciting for it he said that all the governors who work for the emergence of the national chairman did so because of the unflinching support Secondis gave them in the past. Ebony State Governor Dave Umayi said Secondis stood with him when the promise of man failed. He said that all the governors resolved to work with Governor Wiki in conversing for Secondis because of his character and content. He said that the governors turned their backs on those who took money in the past. This is that all the governors, just like Governor Ayode said, they have the same testimony about our national chairman. Good for me. So I want to say thanks be to God for your character. If there is any governor you took one cover from, it would have been very impossible for us to all of us to say yes to wicked it because of your character and content and i want this to be a testimony to other members of the national working committee i know those that took money also contested but i'm sure that all the governors turned their backs against those people so i want to commend you that your character will continue to flourish uh, in his remarks, Abia State Governor Dr. Okeze Kwazu commended the presence of mine of secundus, which he said will be beneficial to the party. We are prepared to go the whole hog with you because you have put Christ ahead of you. I don't have any doubt in my mind whatsoever that you will be not only a huge success but an exemplary party leader in Africa. Also speaking, National Chairman of the PDP, Prince Uchese Kondus, said that the PDP is poised to take over the leadership of the country. Has given us the strength. We may be small, but we are going according to the plan and purpose of God. And this country will be returned to PDP. Whether you like it or not, it's approved in heaven. While thanking God for his grace and blessing that delivered the position of the national chairman, Prince Uche Sekondu said God used Governor Wike and his colleagues to bring the post to fruition. Your Excellencies, I want to thank our dear Governor, Governor Nyeson Wike, who had worked tirelessly to promote the river states to a national level and to thank his friends and colleagues especially our governors that are here and other governors of PDP who supported us in our effort. Without God it wouldn't have been possible. <laughs>